With doubtnet, get instant video solutions to all your maths, physics, chemistry and biology doubts. Just click the image of the question, crop the question and get instant video solution. Download doubtnet app today. So students, we have a question that a very flexible uniform chain of mass m and length l is suspended, suspended vertically so that its lower just touch the surface of table. Okay, so when the upper end of the chain is released, it falls with each link coming to rest at the instant it strikes the table. This means that when we leave this upper end of the chain, then each link as soon as it reaches the ground, it comes to rest. Okay, so we have to find the force exerted by the chain on the table at the moment when this Y part of the chain has already rested on the table. Okay, so we have to find the force ejected when this Y part is already rested on the table. Okay, students. So, students, we have to calculate the force. So, for this force, we have to calculate, let us calculate this force by using a small element which is dy. Okay, of the chain with height of y. Okay, so now the mass. Let us calculate first mass. Let me calculate mass first. So the mass of this chain, remaining chain above the ground will be total mass upon total length into the length of this small element. Okay, so now students, if we can, we know that the when object falls without any experience of force, the velocity of it becomes 2 g y okay velocity of element of striking or when striking on the table okay so now students if you find the momentum okay the momentum will be dp is equal to mass what is mass is m l dy and what is the velocity it is root of 2 g y okay so now students we know that the force let me write it here the force is equal to dp by dt which is change in momentum with respect to time okay so if we differentiate m by l dy by dt here it will be 2 to gy then this dy by dt will become velocity okay and this velocity is equal to this root 2 gy okay so root 2 gy into root 2 gy will become 2 gy so the force ml okay the force ml will be equal to uh, force f will be equal to ml uh, root 2 g8 and 2 j will be 2 g y the answer will be m by l 2 g y so this is the answer m by l 2 g y for class 6 to 12 itj and neat level trusted by more than 5 crore students download doubt and app today